नमस्कार आई एम डॉक्टर अमित भारद्वाज आई वेलकम यू ऑल फॉर इंडिया मेट्रोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग फॉर फाइव फिफ्थ सेप्टेम्बर टूडे ना इफ यू टॉक अबाउट पास्ट ट्वेंटी फोर आवर रियलाइज वेदर यू कैन सी दैट मेनी ऑफ स्टेशन ओवर सब हिमालय वेस्ट बंगाल एंड सिक्किम रीजन रिसीव वेरी हैवी रेनफॉल अमाउंट विच इज ओवर दार्जिलिंग डिस्ट्रिक्ट नाइनटीन सेंटीमीटर ना इफ यू टॉक अबाउट वेरी हैवी रेनफॉल ओवर ईस्ट राजस्थान ओवर बुंडी डिस्ट्रिक्ट फोर्टीन सेंटीमीटर and over telangana 13 cm bihar 12 to uh, 13 to 12 cm and konkan and goa some of the uh, station received 12 cm and punjab received 12 cm and in this picture you can also so uh, see that uh, very heavy rainfall uh, amount has been reflected in the orange color and in yellow heavy rainfall amount has been observed heavy rainfall has been observed over uh, many parts of the indo gangetic plain you can see in yellow and konkan and goa and madhya maharashtra and our assam and meghalaya stations and as well as if we talk about the east coast of india coastal andhra pradesh and odisha adjoining areas of uh, chatisgarh uh, regions received the heavy rainfall amount now if we talk about the today's highlights so heavy to very heavy rainfall is likely over gujarat maharashtra and coastal andhra pradesh on today and uh, over east rajasthan uttarakhand during next 3 days and then it will decrease thereafter now if we talk about today's system so the monsoon trough line now passes from the surat rohtak urai mandla and to the center of the low pressure area which is formed today and uh, south eastward to the east central bay of bengal now if we talk about today uh, so there is a under the influence of cyclonic circulation so since yesterday a low pressure area has been formed over uh, west central arabian sea and adjoining northwest uh, bay, uh, west central uh, bay, uh, bay of bengal adjoining northwest bay of bengal and it is off uh, the north coast of andhra pradesh and south odisha coast so this is the low pressure area is formed it is also tilting southward with height and it's extend up to 7.6 km above mean sea level so this low pressure area is slowly uh, likely to move uh, northward in next two days and if you talk about other system there is a cyclonic circulation over uh, andaman sea at the lower tropospheric level you can see there is also a east west trough from the cyclonic circulation which is over uh, west uttar pradesh and adjoining areas of haryana uh, extend up to uh, 5.8 km above mean sea level and this east west trough passing uh, uh, from uh, this center of the cyclonic circulation to the manipur and there is also a cyclonic circulation you can see over northeast assam and neighborhood areas which is seen at 1.5 km above mean sea level there is also a uh, cyclonic cir- circulation over jammu and adjoining areas which is uh, uh uh seen at 3.1 and uh, trough in the westerlies uh, uh, has been seen at 5.8 km above mean sea level there is also a cyclonic circulation over west central arabian sea and adjoining, a- adjoining areas in the lo- lower tropospheric level so these are the system today now due to these system uh, there are uh, seven days warning has been issued uh, met subdivision wise and the day one forecast which has been issued for very heavy rainfall as you can see that in orange color it has been shown mostly the west coast of india if you can see the region uh, konkan and goa madhya maharashtra gujarat region and east uh, rajasthan uh, will receive the uh, very heavy rainfall amount which is in between 11 to 20 cm today and as you can see there in the uh, uttarakhand region uh, arunachal pradesh as well as because of the formation of low pressure area uh, coastal andhra pradesh a very heavy rainfall warning has been issued for today now the other parts of the country you can see that our mostly uh, yellow color has been shown for the heavy rainfall amount which is 7 to 10 cm so this is day one forecast now this warning will continue for uh, uttarakhand region for very heavy and over east rajasthan for day two and in day three east rajasthan only and then odisha coast will receive for day three a uh, very heavy rainfall amount and for day 3 you can see that assam uh, and meghalaya region will receive the very heavy rainfall amount for the heavy rainfall as you can see mostly it is confined to the west coast of india uh, including uh, northern uh, northwest of india including the rajasthan part gujarat region for day 3 and the uh, east coast of india uh, coastal region uh, uh, met sub region you can see the coastal andhra pradesh heavy rainfall will occur over telangana region chatisgarh and jharkhand region very heavy rainfall uh, sorry heavy rainfall can occur over these regions for day 3 now if we talk about uh, this heavy rainfall spell this will continue till day 4 very heavy rainfall will occur uh, uh, for uh, warning has been issued for uh, odisha coast and the other regions you can see the central part of india and the west coast of india uh, will receive the heavy rainfall amount uh, 
uh, at the isolated location. Now this uh, spell of uh, heavy rainfall will reduce in uh, uh, day 5, day 6 and day 7 and you can see in this picture the spell, uh, the heavy rainfall spell is reducing from day 5 onwards. So these are the warning. Now if you talk about the fisherman warning graphics, you can see that due to the formation of low pressure area over west, central and northwest uh, Bay of Bengal, uh, the fishermen are advised not to venture in the mark these polygon uh, boundaries and they should avoid uh, uh, these polygon areas uh, where the wind speed can reach from 35 to 45 gusting to 55 kmph in the outermost boundary and in the deep ocean you can see that the wind speed warning has been issued for 45 to 55 gusting to 65. So these mark polygon for day 1 to day 5 fishermen are advised not to venture in these areas up to day 5. Uh, that's all for today. You can actually uh, get the detailed information from IMD bulletins and you can download those bulletins from the IMD website and you can follow us on Twitter, Instagram and Facebook to know the updated information. That's all for today. Namaskar. Dhaniwad.